The Spock is a rope clamp, so according to standards, it is only tested for static loads. In practice, you often see it used as a backstop during anchoring or simultaneous climbing. I am Florian Helberg from the Ellerit Knowledge Base, and I would like to address in this segment the question of how high the risk of rope damage is in the clamp with dynamic loads. Here at our full testing setup, we want to simulate what happens if the B layer does not pull the rope tightly enough and the second climber falls. To do this, we will now let this sandbag, which represents the climber and weighs 80 kilograms, fall one and a half meters, placed three meters away from the redirection you see here, in which the force sensor is attached and secured here using the spock. You can see that when the falling mass falls further away from the anchor point, the available rope can soften the fall and there is no rope damage in the clamp. Okay, with our next experiment, we are now moving closer to the redirection point. The falling mass is at the height of the redirection and here is a half meter of slack rope and we'll see what happens when the falling mass falls into the spock. You can see the rope did not break, but the sheath and two of the ten core strands are damaged. The situation must be evaluated as critical. For the evaluation of securing with the Spock, we have a third scenario. This time, we have raised the fall mass to the same height as the redirection again, but have introduced two meters of slack rope here. Let's see what happens. The result is clear, the clamp cut the rope due to the high loads. So in conclusion, I believe we have clearly seen that securing with rope clamps poses dangers. An important point is the amount of rope in play. So if the climber is further away from the stance or the anchor point, the rope can still absorb some of the dynamic fall and it is less critical. When the climber gets closer to the anchor or the belayer, even small falls become critical. Whether this leads to damage or even cutting of the rope depends on factors such as rope properties, fall height and climber's weight. However, it can be clearly stated in conclusion, caution near the anchor point. And rope clamps are tested for static loads and should always be used with caution for belaying.